I think ultra runners we are probably much more stupid than other athletes. I feel much more like home and I feel much more confident and comfortable being in between high mountains with sharks and avalanches than in a city with like cars and like uh, people. I would lie if I say that the motivation for racing is the same now than 10 years ago. The emotions that I was feeling the first time I won like Western stage, UTMB or Zegama, I will never feel again. When like the motivation for competition, it was a bit going down because all the goals I, I wanted to achieve, they were uh, done. Uh, it was the moment to put the two things together, the, the mountains and the, and the speed. I started in Europe, so I climbed at uh, Mont Blanc uh, and uh, Matterhorn. Then I was going to the Americas, so first uh, in Alaska, in uh, Denali, and then to Aconcagua in, uh, in Argentina. Finally, last year I was in uh, Mount Everest. And of course, Everest, it has been a long process uh, to be in really high altitude and the, the feelings up there, uh, the views up there, it's just amazing. The first time I did it, I was feeling good, but then I had like some like gastro problems. We still had like one week more before flying back to home. So like I don't like to spend like time in the base camp doing nothing. So it was like, okay, what do we do next week? And it was interesting to see like if recovery was possible and if it would be possible to do a big effort just a few days after a, another big effort. I hope people get motivation to get out there, get motivation to, to explore and to go to, to mountains. The things that we can discover is ourselves. So pushing through these long distances, pushing through these kind of races, like we can really find that and our limits. <laughs>